Hey guys, good to see ya. Hey gang, good to see ya. Oh. Huh. I'm Joe Harbin. Uh, I am 30 years old. I am on the spectrum and I am mostly independent. Uh, I say mostly independent uh, because while I do take care of myself, uh, I still live with my mom. Uh, but that is less of an autism thing and more of a millennial thing. <laughs> but because of this, I am a part of both communities the autism community and the autism parent community. Which means that I know that both would suck. Uh, you don't have to do a whole lot with that information. Just know that if you heckle me, it is technically an able to crime. <laughs> it is a common misconception that those of us on the spectrum don't understand social media. That is not entirely true. Many of us do understand social cues, we just don't know how to give them. We understand the language, we just don't speak it. Uh, we're like Chewbacca or a Mexican grandma in a single. Uh, I got three main ways that my autism comes across. Uh, selective mutism, which means sometimes I just might stop talking. Uh, info dumping, which means I don't stop talking, and I apologize. <laughs> and uh, flapping, which I'm doing now, and uh, sometimes I talk in sign language and I don't mean to offend you. Some people do feel like Chris, Chris Hemsworth when they wear Dior. But Savage has a very interesting take on this. Because while they do use a very handsome celebrity, I don't know personally anyone that wants to smell the way Johnny Depp looks. Let's move on. I won't eat the vegetables I prepare for myself. <laughs> I refuse to follow the schedule of my name. <laughs> and I am only 80% certain that I'm wearing clean underwear right now. People assume that I don't want to hug. I fucking love hugs. Are you kidding me? Hugs are the best. Side hugs, full hugs. I lift you, you lift me. Don't, don't, not worth it. Uh, I've hugged Ron Funches. I've hugged uh, Eddie. I won't go into the nerdy sci-fi guys. I'm sorry. You won't. We have 13 guys fans at all. Amy McClintock? Yes. yes. Yeah, see, no one else cares. <laughs> Don't do your homework. It's a pink slip. Get three pink slips in a week. That's a detention. It was like a coffee shop punch card where you buy nine drinks and the tenth one is a disappointment to my mom. <laughs> We're all trying to figure out what our loved ones on the spectrum needs and feel. But it's not that hard to figure out. If you just pay attention to what we do and say, Thank you.